legally speaking in the United States of America, you are to be paid for all hours. Morally speaking, anywhere, you shouldn't make any money for faking cancer. And uh, Roll Cow Live, Parks Boogie 2988, fake sir, waiting for the show's best month of all time. Well, the show made approximately twenty-five to $30,000. To be split evenly among four people with $2,000 of it. So at most, $28,000 split among four people is eight sixteen twenty-four. No, it's seven fourteen twenty-one twenty-eight. Is seven thousand dollars. Team Star Boogie rings when Tommy C. Now Tommy C got fired, but Tommy C took a vacation and didn't fake cancer, so he's gonna get paid. So Boogie, everybody's suggesting that instead of paying Boogie, Team just divvies up Boogie's share between Tommy Team and Rings. And honestly, like really speaking, he can't do that. It's a whole contract, you know, hired people, W. View forms and all that stuff, the high nine form, all of those things. Speaking, you should not be able to profit off of faking cancer. Now, Boogie2988 has continued to be on the show. As Boogie has been on the show, he's been doing multiple things. Most recently, he got confronted by Wings of Redemption's wife, who said she doesn't hate him, she just has a strong dislike for him. Which is fair, because he actually had cancer. And, like, I could understand that. I had someone in my family who have had cancer. Boogie2988 faking cancer. Because faking cancer is wrong. But I also don't believe that nobody should be able to be... And I feel that nobody should be able to take away or earn pay from somebody. That's a thing. But it's like one of those things where, like, of these things seem to be morally wrong. It's morally wrong to take away uh, somebody's somebody's money, uh, even if they fake cancer. So, just wondering what is going to happen with everything with uh, Boogie going forward as he continues to be on Locale Live. He did a grocery shopping video for him. He got cookies, Mountain Dew. He got a bunch of stuff. He got a bunch of stuff. Some of it for his friends, some of it for him, some of it for his roommate. I didn't see a lot of, like, you know, chicken, beef, vegetables, or anything like that. But, like, you know, sometimes you don't have the chance to get that. And if you don't have a chance to that, get, get that, it's whatever. You know, remember, fed is best. But, at his weight. It's very likely that he should be exercising more, eating less, and also eating more healthy food like fruits, vegetables. He did get strawberries, which I know they are healthy food, but unfortunately I'm allergic to them, so I couldn't tell you what they taste like or anything like that. Now, my question then is, what is Boogie's plan moving forward? He claimed he couldn't afford $100 worth of groceries. Now, if I walk into the grocery store with $100... I know that I'm probably not going to get a lot of fresh produce, but I can go into the canned section, and for 50 to 60 cents, maybe 70 cents, I can get canned for fruits and vegetables. So let's say I got $100, and it's got to last me two weeks. Well, I can get corn, got fiber in it, got all that. I can get carrots, got the vitamin A. I can get some peas. I can get some green meats. Okay, cool. can go over, and maybe, maybe I get peppers. From the fresh vegetable section. I go over to frozen. I get stir fried vegetables. I get some chicken. I make a stir fry that lasts me three or four or five days. Then I get some other stuff like some processed stuff that's high calorie. So that that way I'm, you know, able to have less food that I got to eat overall. Less times I got to eat and everything. Then the next thing he did, him and his girlfriend Desi. Went out to the side of the interstate. I believe it was the interstate. Well, at least it was a divided highway. And he was dressed as a public safety worker. And he was picking up cash. I'm like, it was ridiculous. The police came. They're like, you got water? What are you doing? We're just concerned. Also, you got to move your car. Which, whatever. That's one of the funniest things I ever saw. Especially because at one point it felt like it looked like Boogie was drinking bodily fluids out of a bottle. 
But at this point, I don't know what Biggie wants. I mean, he's willing to fake cancer. And usually when you're willing to fake cancer, uh, there's not much you want to do. So I'm hoping that Biggie learns his lesson. I don't think he will. Um, it's worrying to me that Keemstar is just letting this go this far because Keem, I know, I know that Keemstar is willing to take this as far as it'll go. He's, he said he's going to bring back drama alert in September. And I feel like drama alert's first story, Boogie 2988 found arrested, Boogie 2988 arrested on side of highway uh, after he does something like this would be funny. But, you know, we don't want that. I don't think Boogie would do well in jail again. His felony is actually expunged now. So he's not actually a felon anymore. But every time I wake up and I look and I see, let's check and see, any new Boogie news today? It just gets to the point where I'm like, I'm not shocked anymore. And I'm like, eh, I'm going to stop watching this. Then he goes and drinks bodily fluid in a disgusting manner. And I'm surprised it's still allowed on YouTube. But it may have actually been apple juice. Um, it may have been apple juice. And it appears that he actually was drinking soda, which was really a bad idea. Because when it's really hot, you got to drink like a sports drink for a few minutes. But because of the um, bladder irritations with soda, you don't want to do that. You want to drink like a Gatorade or a water or like a spring water or something. <laughs> It's just hilarious to see. And I am absolutely shocked at what Keemstar is putting Boogie through. 